more flexibility and and um, no no heads in the way. Oh, it's this guy's shepherd pie. Senpai, still rocking that silver badge, nice. One pa the one pie here is high face. Yeah, I never tried it actually. Oh, it's so loud. I, I really hope they turn it down for the roast. I'm gonna stand here for two hours. Tracy maybe. Tracy likes karaoke. Tra guys, karaoke is really great. Just learn like five songs and you'll think karaoke is the best thing ever. Make sure you go to... Um... Wait, there's two of them. Joy Sound is is a shit, but, but Club Damn is good. Maybe. I can't remember which one's which. I, guys, I, I understand how drinking can become addictive because after you drink a little bit, you think all problems are okay. Do you know what I mean? You feel like everything's going to be alright. Sitting on the stage? What? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's so close, right? Turn the tail, JD, turn it down. Except for your liver, oh yeah. So today, today is, um, this is their eighth roast event. And, and they had, um, they had, uh, they've had a, I don't know, what do you say, sister pub in Shanghai have a roast, like their tournaments, right? And uh, this is the, the the winner of the Shanghai roast versus the winner of the Tokyo roast coming together to do something. Remember, the left corner saw something earlier on the street. Earlier. Oh yeah, yeah, that's right, that's right. At least I'm not cold in here. That's nice. I, I, these drag queens, I don't know. I don't know how they're gonna roast each other, but it might be super TOS. And my hand's gonna be on the off button like this. Yeah, I'm ready.
120. We should still be okay, even with the charging mega, mega, what's it called? Router. Router. Hey, how's quality for you guys? Are you okay? Well, it seems good? Okay. Hey, Tom, you okay? Hey, Andy, good to see you, mate. Walker up, Andy. Good, good. Hey, Tilted. Daniel. What's your, what's your beer rate? No, hey, stop them. Hey, can you emote real, can you make a sound real quick? I'll turn you up so you have some reaction. 3.5, geez. I, I swear, the, the Nighthawk is really great. Yeah, it's, it's set to 3,500. Noisy because the music, right? And if, 
the music stops, people quiet down. It's like a, it's like a thing. Wow. That was, that was your boy, Hippie Lad. When was the last time I was in like a, a thing like this? Super talkative. Maybe we can maybe we can talk to someone. This dude looks like Noriero. Like a drunk version of Noriero.
TOS hack. Power. The real estate game. The real estate game. Why are they also allowed a library? Yeah, good question. The Japanese dude's falling asleep. He's a resident sleeper. Eight minutes. He's got some good books. I can't see anything else. Boogie's baby. I have no idea. I'll give up. Well, guys in the house. Yeah, maybe. Seven minutes. Thank you, uh, Team Remix, Tom UK, GTO Fish, GTFO Fish, Jamazi Hawaii Stream Team. Hawaii Stream Team, thank you, mate. Oh, I'm dying. I can't wait for the thing to start because um, my, my ears are bleeding. It's kind of packed. I don't know, I don't know what, when it becomes a fire. Winds of winter, you saw that? Hipster bar. Probably good, didn't she come? I mean, she, she, I don't think she would be able to, one, enjoy it, or two, understand the roasting. To be honest, and it's not like 2,500 yen. I'm not, I'm not uh, Jake level. <laughs> I'm interested to see the roasting thing. Can you imagine being a champion of roasting people? That'd be pretty good, I guess.
Which is women. Okay. Take so long. 
nursing this one all night, boys, just to let you know. Actually, it's really good because because um, yeah, I, like Twitch streamers in general have a pretty short half life. Probably six beers in by now. Do the pre-show. All right. Zero point zero zero one percent. Oh, but BMW is a top zero point zero one percent company, right? So it's okay. To get it set up properly, and then we'll take it off. Oh, he's too much getting ready. I'll sit one on here in foreign circles. I think having your own foreigner only group, I mean, uh, not foreigner, but only having your own group of friends is pretty necessary with similar experiences. I saw a couple of videos about people moving here and uh, living here, and it's like. Um, you Are you streaming now? Yeah. All right, you want to come and talk, to you, talk outside? Sure, sure, we can say hi. Can you uh, do us a favor and hold this for this gentleman right here? We just, we, yeah, yeah, thanks. Thanks. This gentleman. Oh, it's right. It's actually raining pretty heavily. Hey guys, this gentleman, uh, what's your name? Rob. Rob is uh, streaming to his Twitch channel. Yes. Nice. So he's got uh, a couple hundred people that are joining us this yeah, evening. Yeah, three or four hundred people, yeah. Three or four hundred people that are joining us this evening. A couple, three or four hundred. <laughs> nice to meet you. Hi, Eric. Eric. How are you doing, Bill? Good so, you guys. Uh, Eric is the Shanghai champion. Congrats. Bill is a two-time former Tokyo Hi. champion. The two-time. And uh, he is, uh, they are fighting for the number one contender spot. So okay. The winner of this battle will be uh, challenging the winner of Eric and Bobby's battle. Uh, okay. So this is the first time in Asia that we've done... Uh, like a cr an international one. Yeah, an international and intercity competition. Okay. And we've been in contact with people who run roast battles all across uh, Asia. And this will be... That's, this, that's them talking to you. Yeah. This is pretty good. <laughs> this will be... Um, oh, people are commenting on this live. Yeah, yeah right, right, right. I was really confused. So, okay. uh, <laughs> hopefully you guys at home are not the kind of people that are easily triggered, because there will be some very mean comments tonight. Okay. This is our eighth uh, eighth event, and, you know, we sold well, out, man. so we're glad that you guys could join us from wherever hey. you guys are in the world. Oh, you, you're, like, streaming now. <laughs> yeah, right, right. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay, and uh, and so in Shanghai there's a there's a Good Heavens bar or it's a different one. This is Good Heavens. Yeah, yeah. I mean, in, in Shanghai is it a brunch? Uh, no, like no. Brunch? Uh, it, they they did it at uh, various locations. Okay, okay. Right. It's more on. like to, it's more like a. There's Shanghai is a vibrant comedy scene. There's a lot of really great comedians there. Yeah. And uh, they did their first world battle tournament earlier this spring, and it took us this long to met, organize. Organize stuff schedules. together. Yeah. So right. We have, we have four people flying in for today's Absolutely. show. It's actually four a fairly big flying. production. We've been working Jeez. on it for months. Yeah. Nice. Congrats. Yeah. Should be good. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Excited. Yeah, very excited. Yeah. Alex. Yeah. All right, cheers. Uh, cheers, Twitch verse. Yeah. Um, Let's go. You guys, it will, will be really enjoyed to see your comments. Sounds good. Great. Good nice luck, week. guys. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, I'm excited for it. Enjoy. <laughs> I didn't realize we were live on Twitch. So like, well, we are yeah. live streaming. Yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we are live streaming. We're here at Good Heavens. Uh, this is uh, our Twitch streamer. Over here is our show producer. Oh, my name again. Oh, hey guys, this is it. We are live. Um, we're going to get going in about 20 minutes, but we're starting the stream now. Um, these are our battlers out here in what amounts to our green room. We've got Dan over there, uh, Gene, Eric in from Shanghai. We've got our former champion over here, Bill Miller. Mean Bill Miller. We can't wait to see what he's bringing. Um, let's go in the bar now and uh, set up. But we won't be we won't be going live for like a good 20 minutes, all right? The show. So go pee, go do what you have to do. 20 minutes. Maybe I can wait outside, guys. Is it better outside? It's better outside, right? 
<laughs> but I'm worried about the uh, the old. Uh, let's let's sit over here. I don't know if you can. I don't know if you still have the internet, but uh, let's, let's. What's over here, actually? Much better outside. <laughs> It's nice. Oh, my ears. I still have this. It's legal to drink outside. How are they going to? Oh, yeah, yeah, sure. They, they seem to be like making friends and stuff. So, yeah, this time we're going to play for Harry. Are you, are you a contestant as well? Uh, yeah. Well done. Are you from Tokyo or Shanghai? China. You, how long have you been in Shanghai? Uh, I was there for a year and I was in Chengdu, actually. Okay. Oh, right on. That's Are you cool. From Belgium? Yes, sir. I'm from Australia. Australia? Yeah. Oh. All right. I was born in UK then. I was so. very close. Okay. Yeah, yeah, pretty close. Yeah. Yeah, right on. Just preparing a couple of things. Just kind of going over things, yeah. Nice one. Good stuff. All right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, this is uh, our gentleman. He is going to be uh, on Twitch, yep. running the live stream over there. So there's another live stream. What is the, uh, the Twitch address? Yep. Rob C D E E. Rob C D E E. Rob no. D. Rob C D. Yeah, that's it. -E -E. That's it. So um, his equipment is a little bit better than ours. If you want to switch over to that stream, it's fine. Um, wherever you want to join us, we have uh, some of the comedians milling outside. We got Wayne Miller here. Um, and the end. Uh, he, he's got to get rid of mentally. I can understand that. He's come from Shanghai. He's probably been flown in from another country to insult. To insult someone. So. If only I could get that gig. Let's go inside. Okay, my bad. Yeah, let's let's chill out here. It's a, it's a kind of quiet, but nice and quiet. I think. That, yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we'll give him a few minutes, please. Could be an insult. Right. Yeah. Oh, it seems to be starting. Tokyo. Uh, this is the first time we've had a live competition. Um, we are just waiting for a few more guests. We're going to get going in like 10, 10, 15 minutes. Time enough to go. We'll get going very, very shortly. Thank you. Uh, but uh, I want you guys to say hello to our live stream, everybody. Hi, live stream. So we literally have dozens of people dozens. joining us oh, yeah. from all around the world. Dozens. More than most. Yeah, more than most. Thank you guys uh, so much for being so accommodating. I know there's a lot of people in here. You guys are being fantastic about it. I promise you, it's going to be an incredible light uh, of extremely, extremely mean, mean comedy. All right? So I'll see you guys back here in 10 minutes. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much. We have people. Prepare for a roast battle. I guess you meet someone that you make you find out what they look funny about. Do I change the title? Is it raining? No worries. Oh, it seems to be not that bad. 
the heat of the, the little computer should be good. How many tickets? Not just me, yeah. This is better be legendary. Yeah, right? I'm ready. How are you doing? You here for the show? Do you have your tickets already? Or? Um, no, but my son put me on the list. Okay. Who's your name? Raynaud. A lot of whites in here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm excited to see you. Okay, I'm ready. Where's my is my umbrella still hiding there? Oh, there's somebody else hid their umbrella, but my umbrella is hiding. Yeah. That's loud. Let me turn it down a little bit. They laughed. They laughed at you. They don't like you. I was told three minutes before leave. Hey, tofu. Yeah, I'm ready. They, they, I mean, if they're international champions, that's got to be pretty good. Right? <laughs> Done what, Mini? Hey, Mini? Hey, maybe? Oh, expert using his VIP power. Hey, and our no dub. Hey, bud. Good to see you guys. Welcome. Are you straight now? Yes, yes, yes. Do you want to see it? Yeah, because the fan was checking and I couldn't, I couldn't see it. It's on the website. Ah, uh, okay. If you search, uh, is this uh, Facebook or uh, if you go to Google? Google, but I usually watch it on Facebook. They have a Facebook stream, but I don't know if it's up at the moment. So there's one on uh, Twitch. It's a different. It's, it's, a, it's a little bit different, yeah. Oh. <laughs> but we, he's the address is different. Oh, then no. No, he was checking if we ourselves. Oh, if yours was going up. Yeah. But we couldn't find it. We couldn't find it. Yeah. Really, yeah. <laughs> you You're working here, or? Oh, you're a comedian. Oh, cool. Yeah, I, don't, I don't perform tonight. Uh, yeah, I, sometimes? Yeah, sometimes I do. Oh, sometimes. oh, cool. What's your name if it's okay? Itsuki. It, Itsuki. Itsuki. Yeah. Oh, cool. Bro. Bro. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So you do I, too? No, I'm just, uh, I just called JJ yesterday oh. and, and I said, oh, I, uh, if it's okay if I stream this. He said, yeah, just to link our channel or link our Facebook and so. Oh, different. So I guess, yeah. So you have a different media. Right, right. This is a Twitch. All oh, right. But I've linked his one too and he's going to get the, 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 the VOD later, the video later, so. So it's not live at the moment, you see? But you can do it live, like this one was like last time was, was, like was that? streaming um, yeah. at, at the end at the same time. Okay, okay. But they have a GoPro set up as well, right? No? No? Okay. Yeah, so it might be Rob with the full name, yeah. But I have a question. Right up top? Go for it, man. Okay. If he's soft, go hard. Oh, yeah, yeah, but I'm first. Yeah, by That's it? But you already know the funniest. If you want to start with the funniest. It's a strategy talk. I'm ready. I'm ready to be impressed. I'm ready. Impress me, everybody. I paid and waited for this content. I'm ready. Ladies and gentlemen, we are live. Our DJ Clement. We got me, Bill, over here. Dan Roman in the back. We got uh, Rob. Rob C D, who's doing our Twitch. You can go over there at yeah. robcdee.com. Uh, he is. He looks like his equipment is better than ours. <laughs> we got Luana at the door. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. To there Rob it is. <laughs> Rob C D, come one day, boys. Not today. We're ready to start, I guess. <laughs> sorry, P man, bye. Sorry, mate. Oh. You got Bob, you got the deleted for, for uh, that, bit, that link. How many times? I think it's super. Uh, oh, dude, it's so loud here. Come on, I'm ready. Just a little bit, guys.
guys, just hold on. Just, just a. Gaman Sudu needs to have patience for a little bit. Then we can start. He's talking to the judges.
historic Rose Battle here at Good Heavens in Tokyo. For the first time ever, we are doing an international intercity competition at stake. The East Asian Championships. One person this evening will be crowned the best battler in East Asia. And we are also vying for this. Oh. These claps the are really great. Chalice of Malice. Yes. <laughs> there are three visiting comics from Shanghai, from Shanghai Rose Battle. Uh, the team with the most amount of wins this evening gets to go home with the cup. This is the first international competition. It will not be the last. I guarantee you everyone's been writing like crazy, and we are going to give you an incredible show. Now, before we begin, I would like to ask anyone who is connected to the Good Heavens Wi-Fi, please turn that off. We are streaming, again, to dozens of people around the world, and we absolutely need the bandwidth. So please, if you are connected, uh, I urge you right now to... Uh, disconnect from the good heavens Wi-Fi. All right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, who here has been to Rose Battle before? All right. Who has not been to Rose Battle but has seen it on television? All right, who's a first-timer? A Rose Battle version? All right, let me explain a few things about what we do here. This is not your mom's comedy show. Although if your mom is here, that's cool. You have a cool mom. It sounds like the Jack and the Box This guy. art form uh, started about seven years ago at the world famous comedy store. The way uh, the story goes is that two comedians were getting very close to having a fight. And it was decided that instead of going out back to the parking lot, they were going to take it on stage. Very quickly, uh, the rules of Roast Battle were developed. Uh, there were three main rules. One of them is original material only. Not a problem. Everybody here is a comedian or otherwise a performer. The next rule is that there's no physical contact. There'll be no punching. There'll be no kicking. There'll be no bitch slapping. None of that. Dude. Dude. Oh, God. <laughs> you guys are out for blood. <laughs> Really? Uh, my kind of crowd. Uh, and the third rule is at the end of each battle, we hug. Yeah. Now, I might ask you guys uh, who you thought uh, did a better job, but ultimately, the decision about who wins comes down to these fine gentlemen over here. There are three judges. One of them will be here momentarily. Um, uh, we have over... Well, I'll introduce them in a second. Um, but essentially... Oh, there he is, ladies oh, and gentlemen. Yeah. Um, one of the few people from Australia that's worth talking to, so. Hey. All right, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, one of We're our out of here. <laughs> producers and filmers over here, Kai, also from Australia, so. Am I worth talking to? Yes, absolutely. <laughs> one, again, uh, and if there are any other um, Australians See. here in the audience, we'll be having your money, so that's cool. So. <laughs> uh, so, just so that you guys know uh, what, what is happening, we do... <laughs> choose and try and find uh, the weakest points about the other person and then put them on blast for your entertainment, yes. right? It can be a little bit uncomfortable, but we really do believe in what we do here. We believe that instead of avoiding talk about our differences, avoiding certain words, we steer into our differences, right? We believe that diversity is our strength, and we believe that a safe space from safe spaces uh, can help with that aim. So just before we get started, uh, I want to mention that I used to live in Shanghai. Oh, yeah. yeah, and that's where I started doing comedy. So uh, I'm a Shanghai comedy comic. I've been here for two years. I'm very excited that uh, a whole bunch of people that I know that I've worked with before uh, are coming here this evening. I was actually in Shanghai uh, for an entire month this summer. That's great, because I, like, I live in Tokyo now, but I was there for 12 years, guys, uh, and I really missed the diarrhea. <laughs> I love Shanghai, I think it's an incredible uh -huh. city, but I am pretty sure that place uh, is trying to kill me. Because I remember the first night that I was there, it was the middle of the night, like 2 o'clock in the morning, and I stepped out onto the street, and I nearly got run over by a guy going nearly 100 kilometers an hour on an electric scooter <laughs> that was nearly silent with his lights off. I got so angry. Not because he almost killed me. You live in China, that happens every day. I got pissed off because I wish I could be that reckless. I wish I could give that few fucks. Because if I was that reckless, I would get on a plane, I'd go home to Canada, and I would tell all my friends, guys, this Canada thing's cute, but don't you think it's time we should join the United States? 
see it. Then I would go to the United States, States uh, and I would walk up to every black woman I saw and try to touch her hair. Oh. 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 Then I would go to brunch and walk up to every white woman and just be like, you're basic. You're basic. You're basic. You're basic. You're basic. And before she could strangle me with her Lululemon yoga pants, I would come back here to Tokyo where I'd walk into a restaurant and order off menu. Yeah. Then, because I give no fucks, I would take the burnable garbage <laughs> and put it in the non-burnable bin. For those of you who've been to Roast Battle before here, you know that we have a very lovely and talented ring girl by the name of Tatiana. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Tatiana's been with us from the very beginning. She's a valued member of our community, and for the very first time, she will be battling. Now, what's historic about this uh, is that this is the first time in Asia there has ever been a drag-on-drag -drag battle. As far as we know, it's only the second full drag-on-drag -drag battle that Roast Battle has seen anywhere. So this is a historic event. Uh, and I'm just, I really have absolutely no idea who's gonna win this one. Her, her competitor uh, is the very lovely Stephon, Stephanie St. Slut. Hi. And that's just one of four incredible battles that we have this evening. We also have, returning for the first time in about a half a year, Benai Murthy, everybody. And he is going to be battling one of the co-founders of Shanghai Rose Battle, Dan R. It's going to be fantastic. And then we have not one, but two main events. We have a main event and a co-main event. These are full three-round, 18-joke, tit-for-tat slugfests, right? Between two-time Tokyo Rose Battle champion, me, Bill Miller, yeah. and Shanghai Rose Battle runner-up, Gene George. And of course, in our main event, all the way back from Fukuoka, the lovely and talented uh, Bobby Judo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Our reigning champ, everyone. Give him a round of applause. Yeah. And he is going to be facing off against Eric Alexander, the champion of Shanghai. There will only be one East Asia champ at the end of tonight, uh, and I'm sure they would be very happy if you bought him a lot of beers, or at least the person who lost, because that's going to happen. So ladies and gentlemen, let's get things, very, uh, get things going started. We're going to introduce our judges for the evening. Over here in the left, you might know him uh, as the engine behind Stand of Tokyo. He is on his way out, ladies and gentlemen. This is his last... <laughs> Fucking finally, I'm so glad. <laughs> This is his last roast battle, three-time battler, all-around good guy. Put your hands together for Alex Camp, everybody. Uh, when I first met Alex, he went by the name C-Dog, with two Gs. He's going back to that when we go back to London. I think they're going to enjoy that. I think that'll work. He's grown up a little bit since then. Uh, but if you want to yell, yo, see dog tonight, that will be absolutely fine. Uh, Alex, uh, you wanted to judge this time. What, why, what made you want to step into the, step into the, the hot seat? To be honest, JJ, uh, the main reason is it's nice to come to Rose Battle and get a fucking seat. <laughs> <laughs> I played the system. All I've got to do is pretend to write in this little pad and I can sit down for the whole time. Right, so we got, uh, is there any battle that you're particularly looking forward to tonight? Do you mean, what's the egg mayo on this platter of shit sandwiches? <laughs> yes, uh, and by the way, mayo is always made with egg. <laughs> <laughs> it's only two ingredients, it's only one. Let's not get into semantics, okay? <laughs> Cross transatlantic semantics. Uh, I, my, I'm looking forward to the, to the drag battle. Yeah. 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 I can't wait. I think the viciousness of people who are new to this is, is exciting. I love the rough and the raw. And it's nice because if I squint hard enough, it will look like there's some women in this uh, sausage fest. <laughs> <laughs> Looking forward to that. <laughs> and and uh, obviously, you guys are very familiar with, uh, you know, three time judge Buck over there. He's lost a little bit of weight. <laughs> So Evans, you agreed to step in for Buck who couldn't be here tonight. Which battle are you looking forward to? Actually, I'm Buck's brains, so <laughs> just the body. I'm, I'm looking forward to the battle between Jin 
Jean George and Bill Miller because, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah! Because they come from countries well known for killing black people. Both <laughs> <laughs> First time judge. Uh, so I mean, I mean, thank you again so much for coming all the way out thank from you. deepest darkest Chiba. <laughs> Um, you know, it must be crazy to go from a city where there is only one black person uh, to a room where there's only one black person. We got We got We got us, three of us, we are here. Can we, can we get that other black joke. person and have, have a game of NBA Jam with you? Yeah. <laughs> There's, there's people representing China tonight. Um, NBA's canceled. Oh! Oh! I don't care about NBA. I'm from Kenya. I'm a marathon runner, bitch. Yeah! Okay. Uh, representing Australia, he's an undefeated roast battler. He's like the new phenom on the scene. He was so good in the last battle. Uh, that he basically destroyed Ruben's confidence. Uh, put your hands together for, uh, for, for Harry, everybody. Yeah! Yeah! Thanks, guys, what are you looking forward to uh, tonight? Uh, yeah, I'm excited for the whole thing, but uh, to be honest, I don't know who the fuck these people are. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like, Ozzy sounds so good. That's including the Toko people, so... <laughs> I'm just going to uh, take it as it comes. All right, well, I do remind you guys that you are under instructions to be as absolutely unbiased as possible. Uh, it doesn't matter who, uh, if you know someone from Tokyo and you dislike them, um, uh, try and be as even-handed as possible. You guys ready to get this thing going? Yeah! If you've been here before, you know that we have a chant. Uh, we'll call on you for the battle, battle, battle in a second. But first, let me welcome to the stage. She is the founder and lead producer of the Tokyo Closet Ball, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, they do an awful lot of incredible shows. You should definitely check them out. She's also the ring girl here for Tokyo Roast Battle. Her first time here being mean, but like, on stage. <laughs> Tatiana, everybody! Hi, JJ. So, are you excited for this battle? I am going to ignore your question and answer with a statement. <laughs> okay. My name is Tatiana. That is not because I'm Russian, okay? Actually, my mother is from America. My father is from the UK. So I have a big dick, bad teeth, and I take things that don't belong to me. <laughs> JJ mentioned that I am the uh, organizer of the uh, Tokyo Closet Ball. I have been with Closet Ball for, what is it, like 10 years now? Six. My Thanks. <laughs> Someone say sex after the show. I accept cash, PayPal, and my uh, clitoris has a C card. <laughs> yes, I have been doing closet ball for six years. Stephanie, only one year. So it's great to... I'm really happy to have a new bitch in the pack. Just remember, I'm the top dog. <laughs> Why did you want to choose? You, you suggested I'm Stephanie done talking. Is okay. <laughs> okay. Um, well, ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, let us bring to the stage her first appearance at Tokyo Rose Battle, the lovely, the talented Stephanie St. Slut. <laughs> Why you call me? 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 Why you call
Rearranging all of this, I almost died walking here. <laughs> <laughs> How much is your revenue usually? Because you can obviously improve this corner right here. <laughs> I think you're ready. <laughs> right. I think you're ready. Uh, you accepted this battle against Tatiana. Why? Well, okay. This is my first. Is this working? Yes, yes it's working. This is my first time actually hearing about Tokyo Roast Festival and Tatiana is a really close friend of mine and she actually introduced me into Tokyo Closet Ball as well. So we know each other and we think that we have a bonding as sisters. That's why we decided to do this thing. Aww. I'm really nice. I can't really be mean. I'm saving that for later. Okay, good, good, good. I was worried there for a second. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready to get this thing started? Yeah. Tatia! I need to show my face. <laughs> so many straight face people, it's basic. You need to do something more extra. <laughs> Thank you. I think we might need a new ring girl. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready? Yeah. Tatiana, slut, let's roast! Yeah. Hey everyone! Hi. Now it is no secret that Stephanie loves the white dick, am I right? <laughs> yes, it's true. Unfortunately, her boy toy lives all the way in the city of Kobe. Oh. She's managing okay though. He might be in Kobe, but they sell daikon everywhere. <laughs> I'm eating vegetables and being healthy. What do you gag on? Double cheeseburger and diet car? <laughs> I like that sound. Could you use that for Tokyo Closet Ball next time? No. Uh -oh. Tatiana is the founder of our drag show, Tokyo Closet Ball. Just, just now, JJ has introduced. Please look us up on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. And if you would like to get in touch with all the amazing performers, please come to us after the shows. We have our performers right here in the audience. Hi! Anyway, back to the main story. Tatiana is the founder of Tokyo Closet Ball. I wonder how she can manage so many talented performers on stage when she can't manage food coming into her mouth. <laughs> see, do you see my dress here? It's beautiful, it's tightly fitting. It used to be Tatiana. Obviously, it doesn't fit her anymore. I like thick women. <laughs> <laughs> It's a family secret that Stephanie's grandfather back in Vietnam got rich by selling out his own people to the French colonizers. It's true. That's true, that's true. Everyone, rest assured, Stephanie is nothing like her grandfather. I seen her grinder, she does not fuck her own people. <laughs> to fuck my own people because back in the 70s, your people already fucked mine. <laughs> Talking about history, Tatan is American, I'm Vietnamese. The last time this happened, I distinctly remember it did not end well for them. They lost, they made a fool of themselves, so their descendants have nothing better to do than to be stuck in Tokyo to do stand-up comedy! <laughs> Now you know how I feel every time I see you on stage. Okay, listen. Here at the Closet Ball, we give her the nickname. We call her the Vietnamese Circus. 
How'd she get such a nickname? Well, she loves being under a big top. She can pack them in like a clown car. And this one time, I saw her fuck an elephant. <laughs> oh, mom, I'm a size queen, which is not as big as Dai Kong you mentioned. I'm not interested. Oh, <laughs> is my drag sister, my co-performer, and my good friend in Tokyo. However, I always look up to her as my great-grandmother. Tatiana, how old are you? 29. Why does it look like, why does it look like you were born in 1929? <laughs> <laughs> no more age jokes, okay? I'm not the only one aging. This woman in the front row can see your gray pubic hair. <laughs> That was disgusting, sorry about that. <laughs> oh, is it mine? Yes, it's so, your turn. It's obvious that um, Stephanie is not a native level English speaker, but she has a lot of really funny, uh, specific phrases that she knows. One phrase she's taught me, editorial makeup. That's what I'm wearing tonight. I did her makeup, by the way. Clap, assholes. <laughs> Thanks. She also taught me the word French tips. That's what her grandfather was sucking on in Vietnam. <laughs> but because it's her second language, there are a lot of very common phrases that she just doesn't know. For example, hair removal, <laughs> indoor voice, and deodorant, bitch. <laughs> Why do y'all talk about deodorant? You could use some because I can only smell disappointment and fast food from you. <laughs> I'm ready for next. I'm ready. Tatiana is such a great comedian. She is so funny that even her audience makes me laugh. They're like toddlers following nannies because they already memorized all of her jokes. <laughs> Think of new ones. Ooh. Here's a joke, Stephanie St. Slut. <laughs> Last joke. Oh, fuck. Good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not getting paid enough to memorize this shit. We're not being paid! I am not saying Stephanie is stupid, but three days ago, uh, she was babysitting my puppy and trying to eat the dog food. I am not saying Stephanie is a moron, but two days ago, she tried to drink my anal lube. I am not saying that she's a fucked up coke whore, but when her boyfriend asked for a booty call, she stole my cell phone and stuck it up his ass. Stephanie, your, spell your name, S-T slut. Girl, let me give you some advice. Spell out the full word. Everyone's gonna think your name is Stephanie, the stank slut. You can only think of the word stank because it perfectly describes you as an American. Oh, you touch my ta -la -la. Right, next. Tatiana is so busted in and out of drag. In drag, she paints her face so white like an American eagle just shot white privilege on it. <laughs> and out of drag, and out of drag, she is the American eagle. Her nose is like the beak. She has messy hair, she eats garbage, and she only hangs around the piers to get semen. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, let's go over to the judges and see what they thought. Hey. Hi. Hey. All right, Evans, you want to get this started? Yeah, I'm going to go first. First of all, give it up for them, man. This is, yeah. this is historic. 
You are making history tonight, man. And it takes some real balls to go on stage dressed like that, guys. Yeah. So. This guy's they funny. They real balls, so... Um, <laughs> I, I think it's a hater. I commend them for that. Um, that, was good. that was a very interesting battle, and it was very balanced, I can say, but... Um, Stephanie? Hi. Very good rebuttals, like... You know, she came back strong in a couple of instances. Um, she talked about Tatiana smelling like... <laughs> that was funny, I don't even know what she said, but it was funny. <laughs> so, yeah, Disappointment um, in fast food. That was it, that's it, that's it. That's it. Yes. Hey, Is that your deodorant, JJ? Because you, you know... You know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm gonna... Um, it's, it's tough. And I'm very careful because I'm trying to get my pronouns right, so um, <laughs> she, I'm really struggling here. But hey, I'm, I'm gonna go with someone I can fuck in prison. I'll give it to Stephanie. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Wait, you can make a joke about you going to prison? God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Uh, all right, Alex, who do you got? Uh, well, ladies, you look fabulous. Tell us something we don't know. Oh, okay. That's an attitude. Fair enough. I deserve that. Um, yeah, that was, uh, that was really great. That was way better than I expected, to be honest. <laughs> Like, like your head, uh, Stephanie, it was a lovely gift. Uh, it was wonderful. <laughs> uh, to be honest, I'm glad you did this because I, I battled Itsuki last week and I thought I had too many fat jokes, but I'm glad that you proved me wrong. Uh, <clears throat> there's, room, there's room for ten fat jokes. Um, Stephanie, you, uh, you had really great comebacks, which is something I'm a big fan of. Like, at the end, pretty much every joke you had it. It's like you knew they were coming. Like, you must have known. <laughs> it's like you knew they were coming. Just, just a yeah, that one's safe for a while, guys. Uh, you're great. I like the first. I like the first comeback particularly about what do you gag on burgers? Uh, that was good. Uh, I wasn't a fan of the thing about being stuck in Tokyo doing stand-up comedy. It's a bit harsh. But, uh, I mean, I'm, I'm leaving, but a lot of my best friends resemble that remark. Um, you, it was really uh, the final joke, the American Eagle joke, was really good. Really nice, constructed metaphor. It was great. Uh, Tatiana, so great to see you on the stage uh, doing this finally uh, after just sitting in the corner getting fucking hammered every time. Um, <laughs> but I mean drunk. But uh, she gets hammered. Uh, the first one, the da the daikon one, was great. Uh, the gra my favourite was probably the grandfather selling. Um, uh, she doesn't fuck her own people, the grinder one. I, I, I'm not very good at jokes, sorry. Um, and that was great. So it's really hard, but uh, I think I've got Tatiana for this one. Just, just, just. Thank you so much. Ah, Australia, suddenly relevant. <laughs> Guys, don't you think JJ looks like he's at the airport and he's just received his mail order bride? Yeah! <laughs> yeah. That was amazing, ladies. That was so Thank good. You. That was that was like Glenn Close from Fatal Attraction. <laughs> versus some I'm more of a Glenn far away. Okay. <laughs> This is some clever. kind of uh, evil Vietnamese spirit that bites your dick off. <laughs> I, uh, I loved it. I loved it. Uh, I loved the disappointment of fast food joke. That was that was so good. And um, French tips. Uh, <laughs> French tips was good. But uh, uh, I think I think at the end of the day, I think uh, I think. Jeez, I think uh, as as good as Stephanie Saint Slut was, I think I've got Tatiana von Hoor. Ah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of her very first Tokyo Rose Battle, Tatiana, everybody! Yeah. Come on, you can make a lot of these girls for yeah. amazing! Yeah. Alright, hug it out, guys. Stephanie, I want to, I want to know that you are my sister. I love you. No matter what happens between us, I will always make more money than you. <laughs> because obviously you're older than me, that's why. Oh. Okay, bye, faggots. Bye. Alright ladies and gentlemen.
up, and I cannot believe how awesome that was, and I can also not believe how excited I am for the next battle. One of the reasons I love doing this show <laughs> joke, guys, joke. is because I love watching this next man battle. Bill Miller yeah! is such a fucking beast. And I don't just mean that metaphorically. Hey, Jimmy. This is our co-main event, guys. Gene George was the finalist. Uh, he narrowly lost out to Eric Alexander in Shanghai. Uh, if you guys were here two Rose Battles ago, you'll remember the craziest battle that we have ever witnessed when uh, Bill and Bobby squared off. It is my absolute fucking pleasure to welcome this man back to the stage. Put your heads together for Bill Miller, everybody! Yeah, I like that he, it's, it's like, it was like the soundtrack of your people. Yeah. Yeah. Bill, man, it's exciting to have you back on stage. It's exciting. I'm super happy to have you. Uh, you were you were, uh, you were, were all about it. We offered you Gene George. You were like, yes, let's do it. Uh, tell me why you want to battle Gene. Well, I mean, it's really... It's just on. Uh, no. Uh, that is not on. That is... Uh, I wanted to battle Gene George. I, I found out he's from Africa, and I'm like, whoa, that's so weird. They're white black people. Guys, Evans, you got anything to say about this? That was, that was my question exactly when I saw the poster. So. Yeah. Same question, you. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, he's a monster comedian. Uh, he is a really funny guy. Came all the way over here from Shanghai to entertain you. Put your hands together for Gene George! Uh, Gene, you jumped at the chance to battle Bill. Tell us about it. Um, but that's right, everyone. I'm white and African. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, rapper, my people. Um, <laughs> typical dumb American Bill doesn't know about white people in Africa. Um, I just want to say hi to all my friends and family in Shanghai. Hey. That's not you, cool. All right. <laughs> I am nervous though because I do hear that the camera has ten pounds. So with Bill on here, I'm probably not visible. Oh, fat joke up front. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a main event, it's the co-main event of the show, which means it is a three-round shootout. Here are the rules. We have a five-joke round, followed by a lightning round, which each of the uh, competitors get about 60 seconds to throw in as many jokes as possible. Uh, and then we will go to a third and final round. The winner of two out of those three rounds will become the number one contender in Asia. This is going to be amazing. Are you ready for the co-main event, ladies and gentlemen? It's co-main Gene's mom has cancer. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Straight up front. Okay. It's good to know you're not the only shitty Gene in your family. Oh. Oh, That's right. My mom has cancer, but she manages to look healthier than you. So. That's right. She has stage three cancer. That is more stages than Bill's ever been on. <laughs> And lucky for me, my mom will only die once. Okay. <laughs> uh, well, Gene, Gene thinks it's funny to poke fun at pun, uh, Sorry, Gene thinks it's funny to poke fun at Americans because we don't really know geography. Gene, the only reason you know geography is because you've been trying to track down your father since the nineties. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um, guys, uh, Bill, I'm glad actually Bill made it today. Bill, uh, a couple of weeks before, he actually had a bit of an accident. Uh, he had a great fall. Uh, luckily, all the king's horses and all the king's men uh, managed to put you together again. Uh, 
Shame they couldn't do that for your marriage. Uh, I'm sorry that your wife and your hair left you. Uh, okay. Uh, thank you, the circle jerk of life. Whoa. Uh, Gene likes to show uh, his girlfriend horror movies before they have sex. Jesus. <laughs> and, and she gets scared stiff, which is good, because if they're going to have sex, at least one of them should be hard. Erectile oh. <laughs> dysfunction is nothing to joke about. <laughs> Bill's lived a great life. He's travelled all around the world. Uh, your kid was born in India, I believe. That's yes, right, you've right. been. Um, is it three countries you've been in? Three. Yeah. Three. Great. That's one for each chin. Cheeky. <laughs> <laughs> okay. uh, Gene said that he cried as a kid when he watched the Terminator movie. It's, it's so weird. It doesn't seem like that. Like you would cry from that. It seems like something you would be into being chased by a naked man who, no matter how many times you blow him, he keeps coming. <laughs> That's right. I'm a little bit of a fruit. Uh, it's the closest Bill's ever been to one. See if this works. Bill's really into conspiracy theories, guys. Um, it's weird to me, the only thing he's not paranoid about is how much his kid does not look like him. Yeah. You should be trying to find the truth of who did an inside job on your wife. Thank you, That's HIV Blood Diamond. <laughs> Gene says he wants to move to the States to, to try and make it in comedy. And I say, well, hell, you know, if uh, Hannah Gatsby did it, <laughs> there's at least room enough for one more autistic lesbian. <laughs> all right, I won't hurt it at all. Uh, <laughs> is there one more joke? Is that right? Yeah, your last, your last joke. Okay. Um, Bill's dad uh, died in a car accident. Yes, but that didn't hold Bill back. Ironically, neither did his dad's seatbelt. At least I knew where my dad was when he died. Well, mine's a better driver, so it's okay. Ladies and gentlemen, round one! Do I bail out of this point? I don't know, man. I'm interested. Uh, if you guys thought Gene took it, let's make some noise. Yeah. Bill? Yeah. Oh, you been there? All right. Uh, let's start over there with Harry. How you doing? Yeah, good. Yeah? yeah that was, uh, that was so good. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but that, that last joke, uh, just that really killed my, killed my mood. <laughs> Uh, but I thought, Gene, your, your comebacks were so good uh, that round, and uh, yeah, in spite of the uh, dad, dad, dad jokes, <laughs> I think I gotta give it to you, but still, like, the shitty Gene joke to open up with, I uh, loved, and, um, but yeah, I think the inside job uh, was, was uh, you know, something I can't go past, so I, I give it to, uh, to Gene. Yes. Yeah! All right! Okay. White on white crime, are you enjoying it? Wow! <laughs> it's amazing, man. I love it. I love it. Uh, but it was a tough one. It's very difficult because this, both of them are very strong, you know. Um, I think um, the joke of the round for me is the cancer gene, man. Uh, that was funny, man. Your, your mom is dying, but it's funny, man. <laughs> Good. Um, but again, um, his, his comebacks were, you know, really good. Like, you know, three. He's, you said he's been to all, you know, fewer than three stages, lesser than your mom's cancer stage, right? Something on. Yes, those lines. something like that. Yes, he just English, everybody. Yes, that's what I to say. Holy Fuck shit. you, English is my seventh language, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. 
new stuff. Yeah, that was. Yes. Uh, Alan, thank you very much, white man. <laughs> But um, joke of the round, I'll go with Bill. But overall, um, I can't hold back this round just the way your dad's cousin did not hold him back. I'm gonna give it to Jim, sorry, man. Thanks, Evans, for making my point of view irrelevant. That's great. Thank you. Uh, that was great, guys. That was awesome. Really fast. Too fast. I couldn't take notes uh, fast enough. <laughs> so thanks all for that. Um, Hillbilly Gabrielle Iglesias had some good ones. Uh, <laughs> I like to try to track his dad down his dad since the nineties. I love to hear about an absentee father. It always it just just jazzes things up a little bit, you know. Uh, scared stiff. Um, you got problems with your erection? Talk to me after the show. We'll, yes. uh, We'll work it out somehow. We'll work it out somehow. It's the musical. Autistic lesbian Hannah Gasby wasn't the best ender. Uh, but, you know, I mean, I don't like her, but that's rough. Um, but yeah, uh, the Humpty Dumpty, man, that was good. That was a good one. And it wasn't, uh, it didn't have to be that dirty or me. It was a good fat joke. And I, I like an imaginative fat joke, you know? Um, you know what, that round didn't make me want to laugh so much as it made me want to just care for your families. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really concerned about the units uh, as they are. Um, I'm just waiting for the hug at the end. Yeah. <laughs> but you know what, um, just to give him something to live for, I'm going to give that to Bill. Just because, you know, yeah. uh, ladies and gentlemen, this next round is a lightning round. Yeah. All right, so uh, it's shot. That wasn't lightning. <laughs> uh, 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 not, not, not this show, Tatiana. Um, okay, so uh, it's as many jokes as you can do in the timeline, which is 60 seconds. Uh, Bill started the last round. Gene will start this round. Ladies and gentlemen, let's roast. Yes. I'm going to have to do these on the next side. All right, I'm going to try and make this quick because Bill needs to get back to sliming Bill Murray. Um, <laughs> a little joke there. Bill's an animator, which is fitting because he looks like he could be in an anime about potatoes. Um, hey! Bill likes photoshopping his head onto famous people. It's like a hobby that he has. That's great. You have the head of Homer Simpson and the body of Chief Wiggum. Um, <laughs> Only difference is Homer Simpson uh, actually has a loving wife and kids. He has more hair than you, and he's been in a successful animation. So, <laughs> Bill looks like if white power ran out of energy. <laughs> that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Bill, you look like you played tuba at Comic Con. Uh, <laughs> something you've never been blown out of love. Um, <laughs> Bill, given the state your marriage is in, at this stage in your life, you don't need head and shoulders, you need a neck and lawyers. Uh, uh, Bill So Gross is the only person who showed up to the Human Centipede for a free meal. Uh, oh, fuck, okay. Bill has a face that says, I come a lot on my own belly, and he has a belly that says, I'm pregnant. Uh, Ladies and gentlemen, GJ! Guys, I have to say, I wish you could see what I'm seeing because I'm staring right at Jess over here. <laughs> and she, every joke's like... <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you guys ready? Yeah. Yeah. Bill Miller! Uh, Gene, it's no wonder you're into horror movies. You were ghosted by your own father. <laughs> Gene cried when he saw the new Lion King. He said... Wow, Africa's never looked so beautiful. Zero black people. Oh, come on, joke, 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 joke. TOS joke. Uh, I don't want to say Gene has a big nose, but last year 12 Thai boys got lost in there. Gene, you, you kind of look like a celebrity, but it's very hard to nail down which one. You look like Ethan Hawke fucked a hawk. <laughs> That's good. You look like Richard Gere and the gerbil he stuffed up his ass. Oh. 
You look like Tom Cruise if you start in the movie Eyes Wide Apart. Um, <laughs> You look like Tom Cruise if his impossible mission was to hug his father. <laughs> oh. Oh. Last joke? That was it, I got it. Oh. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, round two! Oh, you can do better than that, that was awesome! Oh. All right, uh, starting over there, Alex, who you got? Uh, some of the younger audience members might need Richard Gere and the gerbil explained to them after the show. Um, Gene. Hello. I just wanted to see how far apart your eyes are. Uh, <laughs> that was Bill. That was, that was Bill. Gene, you did great, uh, but you just didn't, it didn't have the bangs that Bill had. I don't know if that's the order or, mm. or what, but it, you always you have always got loads of good jokes, but they, they weren't quite heavy hitting enough. Tuba at Comic Con I like, but it wasn't banging. Um, but obviously, White Power ran out of energy was great, and people will remember yeah. that after yeah. this yeah. this event is over. That will that will be used on a lot of other friends. <laughs> Make sure you credit G George when you call your dad that, okay? Uh, and, and the final one the, about on the belly, you've got, you've got some nice thinkers that just settle in after a, a few seconds. But yeah, well done. But I'm. Bill, uh, the the Lion King one, uh, the, every everyone was a banger. The the ghosted by dad, I love that. I love ghosting. It's my favourite thing. <laughs> Happens to me all the time. <laughs> so I like to hear, not by my dad, by women. Um, so yeah, twelve tie boys. It was great. Well done. Uh, I noticed a lot of girls were like, yeah. well, I can see that. <laughs> I ghost him. <laughs> Harry, what you got? Yeah, that's tough, man. That was so good. Uh, again, uh, but just watching you two with your uh, with your sheets of paper. I mean, you just look like look like two men's rights activists. <laughs> Like talking points, uh, so that threw me off a bit. But once I got over that, uh, Gene, your white power joke just really uh, kickstarted that round. That was so good. Um, but I think, uh, I think at the end of the day, I think the twelve toy boy, <laughs> toy boys, tie boys. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, we do. I'm still thinking about the first battle. So. <laughs> Twelve tie boys up the nose uh, is probably gonna win it for for, for Bill for me. So yeah, I'm going with Bill. One round for Bill. One round for Gene. We are on to the third round. Are you guys excited? Yeah. Yeah. Yo, can't you see me? What the fuck? <laughs> Man. Yeah. I mean, give me my two minutes, bitch. The next, the next Black Panther's not out for two minutes. Wakanda's forever. Forever. Wakanda. Yeah. Everything you got. Uh, that was that was a good one. My favorite joke was white power, right? a lot of energy. Uh, that's the type of white people I'm looking for. Man. Those are my friends, so that was an amazing job, man. But I think that, you know, Bill just continued telling us more about his family, you know. He just continued the, the story that he started in the first round, and the, the ending was mm, more sad, which makes us more even happier. So I'm going to be happy. <laughs> deliberate the final verdict. One round, one round. Are you guys ready for the third and final round, ladies and gentlemen? It is Bill, you go first. Alright. Alright, uh, China has just created the world's first gene edited baby. It's, that's funny, because a gene edited baby is what Gene calls it when he pushes his pregnant girlfriend down the stairs. Whoa. Speaking of terrible genes, your son. Uh, <laughs> boy, that is a terrible mix of DNA. Uh, <laughs> I think the only uh, worse. Uh, oh fuck. Um, yeah, let me get the wording right off this. Fuck. Oh, here we go. Uh, the only kids that have been pumped full so much terrible genetic material are probably Catholic altar boys. Uh, yes. Kid has a funny face and a forehead like Dinklage. Thank, thank you, Bishop Desmond Poo Poo. Uh, 
That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Uh, Gene uh, wants to become a scuba diver, scuba diver instructor, uh, which I think China is the perfect place for that because they're already used to having tanks on their backs. Oh. Oh. All right. Uh, Bill's too fat to walk, so he has to do his stalking on Instagram. Uh, you look like you're wearing the tits from the hooker you murdered. Uh, okay. Gene's racist dad moved his family to the UK after apartheid ended. Now Gene gets emotional every time he hears the phrase, once you go black, you can't go back. Oh. I don't get it. Oh, what the relation is there? <laughs> I don't get it. That's cool. Um, all right, they say uh, stand-up comes from its opposites, you know? So if you've had like a terrible life, you try and maybe turn that into comedy, yeah? Uh, if you're like a dirty comic on stage, you may be sort of actually quite a nice person in real life. I think that means Bill was molested by someone really funny. Uh, wow, yes. High energy, yeah. Really good molester. No. Uh, Gene, Gene. I don't know why your parents named you Gene when it's clearly your extra chromosome that makes you special. <laughs> joke for this. I just think this is really telling about Bill's life. So I don't know Bill that well, so I had to try and stalk him up on Facebook, right, and find out about him. Here's all you need to know about Bill. The number of photos of his wife, two. The number of photos of fish that he's caught, seven. Yeah. <laughs> Bill would rather show you a dead tuna than the woman who bore him a son. That's, that's crazy. We called them both with a tiny worm, everybody. <laughs> Uh, wow, I'm really glad I saved a mean one for the end here. <laughs> Jeans into anal play. His mom has colon cancer. So that means that Gene and his mom's cancer are both into eating ass. Oh. Talking about my precious ring there. <laughs> Bill lost his in a divorce, let me just remind everybody. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Alright, oh jeez. Uh, trying to think of something mean. Is it mean or nice? Um, mean? 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 Um, I actually asked Bill about uh, his Christmas plans, and he said for his kid, he's gonna buy him a little car, uh, wrap it up nice, put it under a tree. I think that's nice. That's like his dad, who uh, wrapped himself neatly around the tree at Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it was July. <laughs> the meanest, absolute meanest battles yes. in the league. Awesome. <laughs> Wait, sorry, I heard someone yelling awesome over there. Like, you, you enjoyed that? What did you enjoy the most about that battle? Just mean, mean hitting stuff. Just, just mean oh, no. oh, hitting yeah. stuff. Yeah. Okay, remind me not to interact with the audience again, guys. <laughs> All right, uh, you guys had a good time with that one? Yeah! All right, let's battery. hear it from Not our change. judges. Uh, Evans, who you got? <laughs> wow. <laughs> thank you, thank you very much. Thank you very much. <laughs> wow, that was... To be honest, uh, the third round was the shittiest round I've ever seen. <laughs> it was mean, but, you know, compared to the first two, yeah. it wasn't, it did not have that, you know, Punch, you know what I mean? Um, but Bill being molested by somebody funnier than him. <laughs> I don't know, for some reason, Bill, 
supposed to be just killed. <laughs> I don't know. Um, yeah, that was that was funny and um, he, you know, catching his wife, uh, enticing whatever his wife with a, a tiny worm. That was also <laughs> very funny. And tiny you know, it, was good. it's what we see when you look at your stomach. There is nothing under there. <laughs> I can't talk with authority because I have the biggest dick in here. <laughs> yeah, but, but Bill also, you know, Bill had some punches too. The colon cancer, um, it was, it was deep. <laughs> I think it is. Yes. Yeah, and the extra chromosome, that was a smart joke. I, you know, gene editing, um, I don't support women again. It was violence against women, but that was funny too. Um, yeah, sometimes they, you know, it's okay to push them down the stairs. Um, <laughs> I'm not calling names, Alex. See, dog, I'm not calling names, okay? I'm not calling names. Anyway, for this round, I'll go with my African white brother. Uh, can I give it to Jane? Where's Jane? Where's Jane? All right, Alex, call it. Guys, I just want to say, great job. You really fucked up that whole thing that you built up before. Um, <laughs> you did a great job ruining everyone's time. No, I mean, uh, <laughs> no, it's, I, 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 you did, you did good. You did good. <laughs> you did good. Um, but it wasn't, it wasn't as strong as the first two, and I felt like you were digging. And I, it's hard, and it's a lot of jokes, so I totally understand. Um, stand up from opposite Bill was molested by someone funny. It was very good. It was actually, it was me six months ago. <laughs> Brilliant. That's true of everyone on the Tokyo comedy scene, really. It doesn't, happen. It, just, uh, it doesn't just come out of nowhere, does it? Uh, yeah, the I've got to admit, Bishop Desmond to Bishop Desmond poo poo. <laughs> I don't want to give that any credit, but it, it did too. I mean, you know, what can you do? Um, I can't believe you said that last one. To be honest, <laughs> that was fucking horrible. Genes into anal plays mama's colon cancer. They're both eating ass. <laughs> That was rough, man. <laughs> but fair play to you. That was the worst thing I've ever heard. And, and You're in the shit about my dad, right? So it's a lot of guys. <laughs> but that was still alive. Yeah. My dad's dead. Yeah, yeah. 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 Exactly. He just got around to deal with it. I think what it comes down to, on a serious note, um, was you, you, you went for some, some higher level stuff, I think, and, and it didn't always work. I think that the person who had it the most together and probably edged out on the number of punchlines was, uh, in this case, Bill. What uh, Bill? For me, for me. Gene had some great jokes, but there was you know, missing some proper punches at some point, so, uh, yeah. Ooh. Dead heat, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. Yeah, that, that last round, that last round was like watching a car crash. <laughs> Half expected to see. Bill's dad turn up, you know? <laughs> oh. There were so many, uh... Bill, you Desmond... Desmond Poo Poo. Uh, that's, uh... You know, because often these jokes, they're just like, what's the meanest joke we can say? So, sometimes the silly ones are the ones that just, like, resonate, you know? Um, <laughs> but then you've got, then you've got, uh... You know, the wrapped around the tree joke, Gene. That was, um... That was so good, uh, but... So I have to call this, do I? Yeah, 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 yeah So <laughs> look, at the end of at the end of the day, I think, guys, you are both losers. <laughs> One more joke. <laughs> so just uh, keep that in mind. But uh, I think tonight, just for his uh, just just his stage presence over the whole three rounds, and uh, particularly that last round, I'm, I'm gonna give it to Jane. Yeah, Ladies and gentlemen, your number one contender, G. George, everybody. Come on out, guys. Right. That was awesome, Don. Like oh, come on, Kim. All right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, we are going to take a short break. Uh, go out, get to the bathroom if you can. Grab a couple of drinks, have a smoke. We'll be right back here in 10 minutes for the second round. <laughs> Thank you.
Tokyo, they had a Tokyo show and they got raided by Ninja, right? Because they, they paid money. Three months, uh, three weeks, or once a month, or something like that. Yeah. It's a pretty easy content for me, though. I mean, it's a joke, right? I hope. <laughs> it's a joke. It's, uh, it, intent is real. It's ironic. It's, it's, yeah. They're, they're insulting their friends, right? So it's a kind of okay. Maybe. So. I feel like it's uh, hey, yeah. making jokes about family members is pretty hardcore though. I guess it's okay. And the jokes about like divorce and stuff, it's pretty rough, dude. Tim Tam thought of you, thank you mate. I actually saw some Tim Tam today in a store near here. Hey bud, it's good to see you mate. Books, yeah, I don't know, there's, there's some really random books. PHP, MySQL, there's a dictionary there, there's a bunch of novels. A bunch of autobiographies. 